guys so today on Tropicana 7 it is cooking or even baking week on this channel so today I'm going to be cooking or baking lamingtons or gluten-free lamingtons lamingtons is like an Australian kind of traditional sweet um, that's been around for a few years now um, so yeah so basically it's just sponge chocolate sometimes jam and inside and shredded coconut on top if you didn't know what a lamington was already so yeah so if you want to know how to cook these fun cute little easy treats and also actually a bit healthier for you because since it's gluten free and a lot of natural stuff is used in it then please keep on watching okay so this is going to be all the ingredients that we're going to have today so i'm going to just zoom in closely and let you guys know what the ingredients will be today so of course we have the honey we have gluten free uh, plain flour We've got almond milk baking powder vanilla extract dark chocolate eggs and shredded coconuts so and of course over there which you can see where the lights coming from is raw sugar so yeah, and if you hear a kid kind of squealing it will be outside that way where you can hear right now so yeah so they are the ingredients so let's get started with the mixing process for the mixing process we will need three cups of plain gluten-free flour if you can see it right here Now, of course, you can do it in the normal lamington way, which is self raising flour. Three cups. But I'm just going to do the gluten free way since I eat mainly gluten free. It next is going to grab one tablespoon of baking powder. Um, I think, I don't know what it's called in America, but it's not baking soda. Forget what it's called, but yeah, just one cup of baking powder. Three eggs. Um, of course, you can go free range, organic, caged. So fourth mine is free ranged eggs. So next is honey. Um, mine's just going to be the pure strain one. You can use organic. Um, you know local farmers so forth and it's going to be half a teaspoon so yeah mm -hmm. it's going to be another half a teaspoon of any sort of oil you can use coconut oil um, rice oil which I'm going to be using um, you know olive oil grape seed oil any of those do you go towards you want to get uh, one teaspoon of any vanilla extract you can use vanilla pods I'm using vanilla bean paste um, any kind of vanilla so yes, so grabbing a full one, putting it in. Now it is milk or almond milk. I'm gonna do from three fourths, which is about here, which is about two hundred ml. So you might have to add, you know, a little bit more milk depending on, you know, your mixture if you're using your normal milk or doing the normal style of lamingtons, so forth, so forth. But with mine, I just had to add a little bit more milk, so I probably, you know, make it a cup, a full cup of milk or so. On to putting it into the pan, you want to grease it with any kind of cooking oil or even put just um, baking paper down. Of 
Portuguese, they're like, um, if you're wondering, a regular Victorian sponge kind of mix. That's kind of, yeah, I can't really work as well. You can use Victorian sponge or create a normal sponge. Mine's a little bit denser just because of its a different um, flour, so it's a little thinner. Jan. Then we're going to stick it into the oven to stick it in there for 180 degrees um, Celsius, not Fahrenheit, you know, that kind of, that jazz. You just leave that into the oven for about 35 minutes to 40 minutes, depending on, you know, how hard you want your cake to be. Sounds well. But yeah, so while I'm doing, while that's cooking, I'm just going to do some cleaning up and then we'll get on to the next step as well. Okay, so there is sugar over there. We didn't actually use the sugar, but you can use the sugar to add sweetness to the cake and all that kind of jazz. But I'm not going to do that because we have some chocolate here. This is dark chocolate. Yeah, dark chocolate. It's kind of a cooking chocolate. Whatevs. We're going to put some into just this cup and we're going to melt it into the microwave. So while everything's still cooking and all, we're going to just set up the kind of um, layout of how to make a lemington and all that stuff. The shredded um, coconut. coconut. Just pour it all on top of here. Because the coconut is the outside, the coating. Like so. And then we put the chocolate into this one. Okay, so the lemington kind of cake what do you want to call it, is done, as you can tell here, then I'm just going to, I'll just cut some of them into strips, just cut them into whatever size you want, if you can't even see, I'm like pointing it this way, I'm like hello, no, this way, any size you want, like so. That is my gluten-free lamingtons. Basically a lamington is just sponge, chocolate on the outside, sometimes jam on the inside, and just some shredded coconut. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this cooking video. And until next time, thank you for watching. Bye!